ou un Okay, Maria. Thank you very much. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, it's absolutely brilliant to see you here today in the honor of story and our red threading. So we're looking at the red thread of story today. So we have a few little rules. First of all, we're recording this for the Grow Through What You Go Through series that is on YouTube, and we will be sending you all the link afterwards. If you wish uh, not to be on camera, then you can turn your camera off and your face won't appear on the recording. There will be a chance to participate as we go throughout the day. In that case, I might ask you if it was OK for me to bring your face up on screen. It's completely up to you whether you wish to do that or not. So um, so those are the rules out to the left. We have the bathroom. If there is a fire, follow me because I'll be first out the door. <laughs> Only joking. Hopefully there won't be anything like that. So um, in the background, we have Mandy Dyson. Mandy will be putting everybody on mute until we come to the parts of the um, workshop where we will need participation. And Mandy, I warn you, there's going to be a lot of those. <laughs> so let's begin. OK, so we're going to use our chat session section a lot. So I'll be looking down here a lot at what happens in um, our chat. Where is my chat? Right, there it is. Um, so the first thing in our chat would be it would be great if you could Put in your name and where you're from. So we have a little roll call. I'm Maria and I'm from Cork in Ireland. Cork is famous for the Blarney Stone. And if you kiss the Blarney Stone, they say you get the gift of the gab. People in Cork Yard Spinners and my mother as well say that I took a bite out of the Blarney Stone. And I'm saying nothing. I'm not going to say whether that's true or whether that's not true. So um, so if you could put your name into the chat, it would be brilliant. Um, so now our first question of the day in the in terms of red thread of story, it's a mechanism that I would have explored as a drama therapist when I was going in Maynooth. And it's a way of looking at story as a connecting force. It connects us into the future. It connects us back into the past. It connects us now in the presence from one to the other. That's one way of looking at the threading. 